What's up, everybody? Ronald here with another guide in the Xfil Bootcamp series. Today's video is going to focus on the Prapper task, the Bunker Part 2. The goals of this task are to discover certain entrances from certain buildings into the bunker system under the helicopter pad in reserve, and it gets you familiar with how to get in and out of the bunker system. So today we're going to go through each one of the different checkpoints that you have to reach to complete this task. We're going to show you how to get there. We're going to show you how to get back up to the concrete pad where the helicopter is so you can get out successfully. Let's dive in. The first thing I want to take a look at is the actual map of reserve and the specific things that you need to do to complete this task. The bunker part two focuses in the same general area as the bunker part one. Our guide for that task will be linked in the show notes for this video, so please check that out if you have a friend that needs to do it, because if you're on part two, you've already done part one. So the first place we're going to start here, we're going to do a circle around the helicopter. So if you look at the upper left corner of the reserve map, you'll notice that there are five buildings around the helicopter. And these buildings are White Bishop, White King, White Pawn, Black Pawn, and Black Bishop. The five different doors that you need to discover are in each one of these buildings. We're going to start at white bishop and then work our way around in kind of a counterclockwise circle all the way to black bishop at the end. If you look down you can also see this is the actual task progression of what you need to do to complete the task. We need to discover these different areas in the buildings and then we need to make it out successfully. All right let's get started. The first place we're going to get started is white bishop. Now if you look around, White Bishop is that first building on kind of the lower right corner of that circle, that counterclockwise circle that we're going to do around the helicopter. You can see the helicopter off to the left there, and you can see the dome out in the distance. You can use these as reference points to find the entrance that we're looking at here. So White Bishop, let's go in the building. Alright, we're going to walk in the hallway here, and the first thing we're going to do is Notice that we make it kind of towards the end of the hallway here. You can look back for reference from where we came in. We're going to go down these steps. You can see there's nothing to the right. Nothing straightforward. We want to go to the straightforward here. And then we want to go now if you notice here as we kind of make it through here it gets a little confusing and that's why we've slowed the gameplay down so you can take a look around and have good reference points so as we walk through the tunnel here we're going to be ending up going to the left we're going to be going down this ramp and then we're going to be going to the right and if you notice there we have subtask complete this is the first area that we need to get to now to get back out we want to get out without getting lost we're going to head back up the ramp Head back up to the right, to the left, to the right again. Kind of see down that hallway, kind of see over there. We're going to go back up the steps. And then you can see the entrance that we came in originally is right here. And we are successfully right back out where we started. So if we look around, that is the first spot that we need to find in the White Bishop building. Now we're going to head over to White King. If you look at White King for reference, you can see there's the dome. 
There's the helicopter. If you notice, we've moved. The orientation of the helicopter is a little bit different now. There's the White Bishop building where we just were. So we have just advanced one building up across the street and we're heading in the front door of White King. We take a look around, we make a left turn. We walk up to this locked door. We open it, you do not need a key. You can open this door without a key. We go down the staircase here. And we continue on, you can see the bunker door there. You get the chime, subtask complete. Now the next thing we want to do is work our way out backwards the way that we came so we don't get lost. You turn directly around, head straight back for the staircase. Make a left through the door that you opened on the way in. And then make a right, and we'll be right out back at the front of the building where we started. And again, you can see the orientation of the helicopter to the front of the White King building. All right, next building we're going to go into is the next building to the left, which is the White Pond building. You can see the orientation of the helicopter. We've moved up one building and across the street. And so now let's go in. We're going in the dinosaur entrance, I like to call it, because the dinosaur that's on the right side of the entrance there. We're going to go down the steps. We're going to go around the corner to the right and into the bunker system. You're going to hear the chime. And in this particular case, we're going to use the tunnel to get out the other side. So we're going to make a right turn. And we pass the white pawn, as you can see. We come, we're going to come to an intersection up here, and you can notice the rip in the paint there, those paint chips. I use that as a landmark reference. Then the white pond, and we make a right turn, and we come up the steps here. We go out the bunker gate door there. We're going to have to open this door as we're working our way around. Make a left, and look down the hallway and see there's nothing really there. We kind of take a look around. This is not like the other side. So we walk back towards, in the same hallway, I'm just going and giving you a 360 view. What you're going to want to do is make an immediate right. And you go right up the steps, out the door, and then we are on the other entrance for White Pawn, right across from the helicopter. You can see this for reference as we'll be heading to our next building, Black Pawn, right in front of us, right over there. Alright, now as we get to Black Pond, we are now on the fourth building and we continued our kind of counterclockwise rotation to the left. We're going to head down to the basement of Black Pond. So we go down the steps, make a right, make another right. Going to walk in the bunker door here. And you're going to hear a chime. This one's relatively close to the surface. I wanted to give you a little bit more so you can kind of see what's in front of us there. There's a hallway that goes down into the bunker system, which you do not have to go down into to complete this task. So now we want to turn around and not get lost and make our way back up to the top by the helicopter because we use that as our orientation to reset for every one of the task points. So we walk back through the bunker door, walk back into the building, make a quick left, up the steps, and then we're right out back in the courtyard on the other side of the helicopter, right where we started. And that is the black pond. All right, the last one's a little bit tricky. So here's the helicopter for point of reference, and this will be the Black Bishop building that we're gonna be going into. Now the entrance for this building is actually on the back side, and you can't get down into the bunker system without going around the back of the building. So I wanted to give you a nice big broad field of vision so you have a good orientation for where I'm going here. 
So I'm going to go around the building to the right side. Going to make a left turn, walk down the side of the building. Then we're going to make another left turn, and we're going to end up going into this back door area, shed area. Now, you're going to see there's going to be holes in the wall, and that's what you're going to want to aim for. So there's the first hole in the wall here. We're going to make a right. There's another hole in the wall here. And as we advance through this room, you're going to find there's another hole in the wall here. We're going to come into a hallway. We're going to make a left turn. And we're going to kind of come down towards the end of this hallway. Now, it's kind of dark. You may want to bring a gun with a flashlight. If you're going to pistol run, throw a flashlight on a pistol. could help you if you need it in any one of these situations. Get down to this hallway. And we're going to make a right turn. Wanted to look around, give you a chance to see what's there. So we're going to make our right turn. I got hung up a little bit on the uh, cart there. And as we walk down the hallway, you can kind of see in the shadows there in the fog, we're getting into the bunker system. You also notice too how the sound changed, the ambient noise changes. So now we want to walk back up. We're going to walk back to the hallway. To get out here, we're going to make a left. We're going to walk back down that same hallway that we came in and find the first hole in the wall on the right side of the hallway. There it is. We're going to make a right turn. We're going to walk back through this room, through this hole in the wall. We're going to walk through this hole in the wall. And then we're going to walk back out the back door, or the shed door, as we like to call it, of the Black Bishop building. And we're right back kind of where we started. And for reference, the helicopter is right up through the little gap there between the two buildings. At this point, you should have the task complete, and the last thing you have to do is exfil. If you watch the bunker part one, the exfil that is commonly used by pistol runners is the manhole exfil which is back over to the right of white pond down the road a little bit there's also other exfil options the d2 exfil option which is the new exfil that's available to be used now which is actually in the white pond building and look for another exfil boot camp video coming very soon that explains how to extract from the D2 extract, which is always available. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this guide. I hope it helps you get through this task. I hope you get a basic overview of the entrances to the bunker system in reserve. If you have any questions, please join the Xfil Discord. The link will be down in the show notes for this video. There's over a thousand people there who love the game, who are willing to help, and we've got a great community that's being built up. That's it for now. We'll catch you on the next video. Thanks.